Hello class. Today we will be learning how to subtract integers. Awesome. A new episode. Hi, welcome to my shop. Feel free to look around. I need a few supplies for my climb up the mountain. Make sure you keep weight in mind when you're choosing your gear. Being overloaded at high altitude can be life-threatening. Thanks for the advice, man. How would I go about figuring it out? If you can carry 50 pounds of gear in your pack, and you have already packed 30 pounds of gear, how much more gear can you pack? When you are subtracting integers, you actually need to add the opposite or additive inverse. So 50 minus 30 becomes 50 plus negative 30, which equals 20. Cool. Well, thanks man. I'm gonna shop around a bit. And you should probably keep an eye out for the Yeti. As well. Wait. What? There's no such thing as a Yeti. Suit yourself. But that mountain has more than one secret. That shopkeeper has lost his marbles. A yeti? Yeah right. I need to start a fire and try to catch some dinner. How much fishing line should I let out? So if the fish is 5 feet below the water, and the end of the rod is 6 feet above the water, that's 6 minus negative 5. And when you're subtracting a negative, you need to add the inverse. So the two negatives become a positive, and 6 plus 5 equals 11. I think I'll get started climbing now. I sure hope that fish is enjoying my music. I hope that climber is paying attention to the weather. It can change rather quickly around here. This is a breaking weather announcement. A severe storm system is forming in the higher elevations with heavy snowfall and hurricane force wind. Let's figure out how cold it is going to get. By subtracting integers, it's currently 4 degrees. The temperature will fall 8 degrees today. Remember when subtracting integers, you're actually adding the additive inverse. Or, adding the opposite. So instead of 4 minus 8, you get 4 plus negative 8. And 4 plus negative 8 equals negative 4. Lone Climber, last seen heading up the mountain. Feared missing after yesterday's freak storm. What happened? Where am I? Hey man. What are you doing all the way up here? I just happened to be in the neighborhood. I had the strangest dream, 
that I rode out a deadly blizzard in a cave with a Yeti. His name is Freddy. Whenever he finds a lost climber, he always brings them here. Now come on in, I'll get you a ride back down. The mountain climber feared lost in the storm, has been found alive and well. Although experiencing some mild delirium, he's expected to make a full recovery. Now, let's take a look at a more complex problem. This three-step problem might look a little intimidating. But they are actually quite simple if you follow these steps. First we will add the inverse, or opposite, so negative 4 minus 6 becomes negative 4 plus negative 6. Then minus negative 2 becomes plus positive 2. Now you'll want to combine your like signs. Negative 4 plus negative 6 is negative 10. And finally solve the problem. Negative 10 plus 2 equals negative 8. And here are some practice problems so everyone can try for themselves. The answer key will be at the end of the video. Thank you for joining us. If you like our content please subscribe and check out our other videos. Hey look! Surviving Math Aliens vs People is on!